Now, the best time when to dig the roots is very early spring or late fall when the roots are actually packed with energy and when it's the best time to dig them to profit and to avail, avail of their medicinal properties. So I just dug a few of them because it's end of April and um, those ones that were actually before blooming so they haven't bloomed yet so there is still lots of energy and valuable stuff I mean it's through the whole year but the best time when you really want to gain the best benefits would be now or then end of fall so I dug few roots because I want to make some tincture and you can use either fresh roots or you can use um, dried ones both of them would work um, if you're using fresh ones I'm using as I'm using now um, you can or I would advise to use higher proof of alcohol because you have to um, bear in your mind that there is moisture in the um, in the roots while when you are comparing to the fact when you're using dried roots you know that it's dried stuff dried material even though all the elements are packed or are locked in the dry material but still I mean there is no moisture so you have to bear in your mind there is moisture in the in the fresh root so you better use higher proof of alcohol now what I'm doing here is I'm doing tincture right so I duck I washed a few roots uh, then the lion roots but I want to add some um, I want to add some stinging nettle roots as well I just duck today uh, just to um, use their strength and their energy support and uh, as you know they have a lot of hidden benefits like energy kick and very good for urinary troubles or prostate issues or actually lots of stuff and you can hear about it in my previous videos so I won't be talking about um, stinging nettle, stinging nettle roots today but I'm just adding them in my dandelion root tincture as well so what I'm using is dandelion roots some leaves of dandelion they are a bit wilted so because they are full of water so I will get got them wilted a little bit and I'm using some uh, um, dandelion and nettle roots so what I did is I washed them I um, cut them a little bit I chop them and I smash them or I crush them perfectly so they will actually release all the benefits and it will be easier it will be easier to relieve, release release all the all the um, all the goodies they have in them so it's good if you cut them chop them um, if you crush them perfectly as I do here so they will really they, they will really literally open themselves like you see they look like they are fibers pretty much so you can see in them it's good to open them so alcohol can get through them and can extract that's the point to extract all the benefits not just to tincture them in the whole way some people would also dry them up grind them up and then tincture them that's good as well that's what I'm doing sometimes as well but today I just decided I want to use fresh roots so the key in my tincture doing is that I open the roots perfectly and I'm using high proof of alcohol if possible but today I will increase potency of the tincture by double extraction well if I can call it that way uh, what I did already is I have another tincture then the lion root and leaf tincture here which was already done some while ago so this is already ready to go tincture I'm using it but today what I want to do is I want to extract these fresh roots that I just got ready and I want to extract them in already dandelion root tincture which will increase the potency so I have another jar ready here where I will place all my chopped and cut 
roots dandelion and stingy nettle roots and um, leaves of dandelions so all in the jar I will chop it more, cut it more, because I like when the when alcohol can go through the roots and can extract er everything, all good is perfectly. I will smash them, as I said, and I did actually before I was doing video. So, as you can see, that's my ready to go roots. I will place in the jar, glass jar, always use glass jar never any plastic or anything similar so that's all roots and I decided I will actually add a little bit of wild clothes roots that I found last week in the woods I dry them and kind of grind them up I have them here real clothes flavor and uh, aroma uh, this kind of wood ovens it's actually called wood ovens or herb bennet I think um, it has the ability to help you to get rid of toxins and uh, actually pesticides and pollutants from your body, the roots of this wood oven. So I have it right here and I will use a few of them, just a hint of the roots in my dandelion and stingy nettle root tincture. Um, it's quite interesting to use this um, wood ovens roots alcohol tincture polluted with water when it's ready ready tincture and just to wash your guns in it it will strengthen your guns it's very good for your gun so I'm using few of the roots in here that are already dried up and ground up so alcohol can go through the roots and can extract them perfectly as well so that's them as well roots so it's all root tincture and few leaves of dandelion as I said I kind of washed them before and dry them up a little bit just to decrease some moisture in them I know there is still moisture but and I won't pour over with just regular alcohol but with already extracted tincture just to increase the potency so this way I will get more potent root tincture and I will let it sit um, in my windowsill um, for about four to six weeks even longer I usually let all tinctures sit longer with the roots and I keep using them and I always keep leaving or letting the roots in the tincture still um, extracting and using them as I said um, so that's something like increased potency of this tincture and just keep shaking it every day day or whenever you it come across your mind and uh, shake it every day and then start using it in about four six weeks two months and then when it's ready to go when it's all tinctures just all tinctures extracted just keep it in keep it in the cooler and some darker place to prolong shelf life so this is very good um, liver and uh, blood purifier great tonic and as you probably know um, researches that were made showed that this dandelion root has potential to kill certain cancer cells like colon pancreatic breast prostate and uh, even le leukemia uh, cancer cells that's what studies showed that it might help to combat these kind of cancers so why not to use it except that it's great for your liver for the sluggish liver it'll dandelion root now talking about dandelion, dandelion root that it'll support your liver health and uh, it can prevent the damage caused to the liver that were caused by alcohol so it's good for hangovers as well and to detoxify your body for all your inner organs so this is what what what's what are the benefits of dandelion roots 
Cheers.